Hallelujah. Once again, our overlords of Game Maker have gifted us with the newest iteration and we got some new features, which is this dude here. Oh, bling bling time. Yes, loving it. And then we got that stuff, um, which is, I guess, good too. So let's go over the boring stuff and then we just quickly jump into the newest iteration. And if you just want to have the TLDR, should I upgrade? Yes, 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 definitely yes. This is a sweet feature. I love it. So we got ourselves the more minor things. You can just loop, just place kind of a flag in between at some point, uh, point uh, in, in a song and then you just loop it. Wow, see. Then <laughs> you don't have to log in anymore on startup, which is kind of neat. So if you got annoyed by that, here you go. And then there are different kind of formats for surfaces, so you can have them with li less or more channels. That just means they are gobbling more or less uh, on your VRAM. So basically they can be uh, less resource intensive if you like. So maybe you don't want it to be like super full color. And this is pretty much it. And then we go to the bling bling part. Mr. Particle Editor comes with a new asset class and you can customize your particles and you can just place them and spam and, and design them and do that on the fly which is the best part so let's actually go into game maker and see what that looks like so here you see a new little system double click on that dude then with the inspector go away here um you can just i don't know create different kind of emitters and then you just can customize and they had some pre-designed ones so i guess what is it electricity it actually looks pretty sweet and then uh, i don't know you can place a few of those okay uh, <laughs> you can place a few of them and just test them out and of course you can just i don't know change and just i don't know do some shenanigans here and just play around with that which i do dig i don't know what did i do here i have no idea but of course you can just place that stuff on the screen if you like so on your asset layer so here and then you can just place that dude here and then play it if you like check out how it does look like or well, just place it during runtime but once again cool cool stuff and of course this one is the best one so once again is this worth upgrading in my opinion yes because it enables the new asset class of uh well that thing and then i got the gm electricity sprite SPR here. Not sure how I got that, <laughs> but I got it now. So uh, I guess now how that looks like. And once again, that should be a pretty short upgrade uh, update on uh, Game Maker. Once again, this new thing is really powerful. From here on now, this will be a new standard and a pretty good standard because uh, once you have these guys here, you can create, you know, local imports and share those things for other games and you can just hot swap them yes 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 a pretty cool stuff from my side so once again what has dropped well the newest uh, update on game maker let's make this video super short and sweet with the bling bling part which is this dude here tons of customizability just play around with it i will do multiple videos on creating the multiple effects so here one of my favorite tools ever ever almost ever ever and then well, the rest is <laughs> whatever, but you're uh, just loving that. So if you're thinking, should I upgrade, should I not? If it ran the last three, four times good for you, then this should run good also. I really, th that was it from my side. Have a really good one. Wanna bendy.